What's up everybody? We're gonna do number two in the series and today we're gonna do two of these boxes since we already did the uh, the intro on what we're doing yesterday. Once again these are uh, courtesy of my boy Distrato 451. We're gonna rip into them see what kind of cool stuff we can get. The last one we got some Ixalan, some Hour of Devastation, or no, was it on? yeah it was Almond Cat, not Hour of Devastation. I ended up pulling a, uh... here, got them right here. That's the good stuff we got out of the last one. Not a ton of great stuff. The Vivian's kind of cool, but it is foreign, so that makes it worth, come on, focus, focus. Focus. Wants to focus behind it. Sorry. But that's going to be our best one that we pulled out of the last one. Foreign makes it worth a little bit less money, but. Alright. Well, we saw the pack on that one. Saw a couple packs. Alright. First off, we have Ixalon. Oh, Rivals of Ixalan. Ixalan. Are these going to be the same packs? 2019? Yeah, that was the same pack. Ikoria. Exact same packs, dude. And exact same foils. Ruh row. Might be selling play sets and stuff. Alright, that's cool. Let's see what we got. See if we can get some, uh, some good stuff out of these, uh, these packs. Somebody had some Ixalans left over. Sirens Ruse. Oh, well, that's a decent card. Sentinel Totem. Oh, Glacial Fortress is a nice card. Not a bad pack. Glacial Fortress should be a couple bucks. Aspirant. That'll sell. Enter the Unknown sells. And Itali. Not too shabby. That's a decent pack as well. Not a ton of value in there, but not bad. Next is next up is Amon Ket. I gotta be difficult, Amon Ket. Give me an invocation. There's Vizier Deferment, on Crop Crasher, Shelter Ticket. Not bad. That's a buck. Twenty nineteen. We did this yesterday. I couldn't figure out if anything was good in twenty nineteen. Oh man, give me at least one mythic here. Oh, novice knight. Well, I got a lot of lands. Detection tower. None of the really good lands, but it's always good to get lands out of these things. And now, Japanese Ikoria. Now these Ikoria packs are straight up. Same as Ikoria, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, there's no, like, the War of the Spark where there is alternates. Okay, so... Oh, that's nice. That's a full art. Too bad it's a terrible rare. That was weird. So we went... Oh, because of the, the little icon. Okay. All right. And that was box one. The Japanese stuff looks to be backwards. So I gotta remember that next time. That's kind of a cool card, but... Too bad this Japanese. Uh, I want to say it's Blighted Bat or something like that. Blight Bat? I can't remember. <clears throat> I do remember I opened a case of Ikoria and I got at least a place out of that thing, so, and remembering that, you know, when you go through and you go try to evaluate your, uh, your pulls, and you got five or six of one card and it's, like, the worst rare in the set. You tend to remember that. But, alright, let's tear into this one. Yep, they're going to be the same packs across the board, aren't they? Oh, I got a different... Oh, that Beast Whisper is nice. That's a cool promo. Different promos this time. That's cool. 
Maybe I'll have a different pack or two in here. What do we got? Oh, we do. Theros Beyond Death. Guilds of Ravnica. Rivals and Ixalan. So we got a little bit different here. Which one's the foreign? So we got Guilds, Theros. Oh! Oh, I didn't even see that. Damn, Collector Booster. Look at that. Foo, foo, foo. Come on, let's pull some big stuff out of there. That is what I'm talking about. It's like a rush before you even get to open. Oh, that's a good card. Fleet Swallower. Odapak Huntmaster. I think I'm selling those play sets for five, six bucks a piece. Can't remember exactly. That's a playset. That's four of them. Dead man's chest. We got a foily back there. Moment of triumph. Nothing. Nothing exciting there. Let's put those rares together. Oh, I'm super excited to open that Theros Collector's Booster. I have not opened a Collector's Booster yet. Uh, I have a Collector's Box of thrown sitting up here unopened hoping that it goes up in price citywide bust decent card just chilling but I have never ever opened a collector's booster so it's the first for me thank you thank you distrato you are the flipping man lightning strike that's always good graveyard marshal Nothing too exciting there. This is the excitement for me. Every card in here is going to be foil. Every card in here is probably going to be damaged because we know how... Uh... God, I want that focus today. Let's see if I can get that to focus. There we go. Alright, we've got a Flummox Cyclops. Unknown Shores. Chain to Memory, Hyrax Tower Scout, Island, Mogus's Favor, Sweet Oblivion, Clothice's Design, and those beautiful mountain and islands, Underworld Sentinel, that's not even foil. What is that? I thought they all had Shadow of the Sky, the Temple of the Bay. Oh, nice, Ashiok. All right, so let's go back a moment here. So these are all the foils. We've got a regular old rare here, Underworld Sentinel. We have an extended art, Shatter the Sky. We have a foil, Temple of Abandon. We have a alternate art, extended, Ashiok, Nightmare Muse. We have a showcase foil Renata and a foil soldier to soldier goat token. Interesting. Okay. I'm gonna say that but that was that was a hit for sure. I believe that Ashiok's like, I don't know, 15, 20 bucks still. Um You know, those lands I could sell for at least a buck a piece. So that's that that box was definitely a hit. So very nice. Good, good opening. I like it. All right, folks. Well, that's it for uh, video number two. We got two boxes. I've got three of those left. Maybe I'll do a uh, maybe I'll do a three count uh, next time, uh, just to see what we can get out of a out of three of them. See if we can get another one of those collectors boosters. I didn't even re I, I know we read it the last time, but I totally forgot. So. Awesome, awesome. All right, guys, thanks again for tuning in, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow night. We'll do some more of this. See ya.